Welcome back everybody, my name is Doragon, this is our Pokemon Diamond randomised Nuzlocke. We are back in Hearthrum City, and I was going to head to the gym leader, but I have discovered subsequently that even though I've gone and defeated the other two gyms, she's still not here. So where is the gym leader? I can't precisely say, blah de blah So it turns out, I need to go talk to her family and get a specific TM. And that means traveling all the way. That was the wrong button. That's the right button, the town map. It means traveling all the way here to Celestic Town. How I get there, I don't know, because if I take the route down to the bottom right here, it's blocked off by Psyduck. So it's got to be a case of go back on myself, up and around. So let's have a look. Route 208, there's no up from here. There's no up from here. There's no particular up there as well. There might be if I ever get a rock climb, but I don't currently have that. Mr. Karate Kung Fu Man, please go away. And this is now the mountain. So my only expectation is that I have to go through the mountain and there's a more upward route where I can exit. So let us go through and... Because we're going to need Surf to get out here. Because we're now back out on Route 207. If we check that map again... It's got us here. So maybe if we go up to Eterna City, maybe that's the way. Although, there's this path through here. Mount Coronet. But I'm very sort of... Without surf inside it... I don't see how I'm getting there. So it's back up this way, back up the cycle route. Up we go all the way into the gate at the other end. Run through. So we're in Eterna City, so I've got to be able to go north out of the city now. Okay, how on earth do I get there? Ah, more cutting. I could cut that way. And that would take me to whatever that item is. But I still feel like I should be going north, but I should check the map. I don't think I've ever checked a map this much in a Pokemon game. So, if we go east here, we should just get to the new region that I require. So let's see what this note says. History living. Okay, cool. So we've got our Route to 11 encounter. This is where we got Toll and then promptly killed him. Wow, really? Just one step in grass and we come across a super... So, what we will do is run away there. And we got away safely. Excellent. Right, run through. Go across. My days, the encounters. Hello, Murkrow. Run away, because you're going to be useless to us. So, across the bridge we go. Right. Oh yes, a new entry into the mountains, some fights, this should be quite good. See how Mount Coromet towers above us? I want to be big like that one day. You're not going to be as big as a mountain, mate. That's a bit much that you're asking there. So you've got two Pokemon, Malcolm. You've got a Paris to start with. Now Liz is not super effective against you because you're Grass-type. 
fact, I think you might actually be fairly effective against Liz, but we're going to go with a body slam, because I think we are that much bigger, that much stronger, that it should one-shot you. And it does. But it did put Liz to sleep. Rude is what that is. 300 XP. Excellent. About to send in Weeping Bell. Yes, we're going to switch Pokemon because Liz is weak to a Weeping Bell. We're going to send in Connor so that he can ice this thing. Hello, Weeping Bell. Fight, Icy Wind, and they should one-shot it. Never a worry, this particular Malcolm person. Excellent work, guys. Well done. So close to level 27 for Connor there. Powerful presence towers before me, and it's you. Right, so it's the entry, entrance to the mountain. There's also a rock break opportunity, but I've got nobody with it just yet. No, yes, I do. But a Pokemon may be able to smash it. So if we go into our Pokemon, we go to Liz. Liz, Liz what moves do you have? Double kick, not rock smash. Rude, rude. I don't particularly want to use rock smash because it's not a good move for the guys we've got. But I'm gonna need it if I'm getting through the mountain. So let's have a look. Let's see if somebody can learn it. TMs and HMs. So it's in the HM section. Rock Smash. Let's have a look, see if anyone can learn it. This is actually a fighting type move. And Liz is able to learn it. Kai is able to learn it. But I feel like Kai is just going to get better moves as we go on. If we have one that Liz can't move, use, and she's using Rock Smash instead... Rock Smash is fighting type, stronger than double kick, so she obviously learns to 40 rather than 30. So yeah, if we forget double kick, we'll keep the one fighting type move. We'll have Rock Smash instead. It allows us to get through a lot of places. Slightly better move for Liz. And it means that we don't have to keep going and switching into a HM slave. We've had our Mount Coromet encounter. Even though this is a second section of it, we've had the encounter in the lower part. So Swellow, I would have really liked you on the team. You are a good Pokemon. But we are instead going to have to kill you. Oh darn, this is asleep. Well, we'll keep going. We'll try and wake her up. Ooh, Swallow is setting up. Setting up for those crits. Wake up, please, Liz. Excellent. And she used Rock Smash. Nice fighting type move. Surprisingly didn't kill it. We'll go once more. And that will be the end of Swallow. You'd have been a nice encounter, Swallow. A flying type. Definitely type coverage that we don't have. But we've had our mountain encounter. We had it down below. So... We can only take what we can take. Would you like to use Rock Smash? Yes. Rah! And through we go. Can I use this one? It's a big boulder. Oh, so I'm going to need somebody with strength. Oh, do I have strength? I can't believe. Yes, I have strength. Strength is actually a really good move. And Liz is able to learn it. Uh, so is Sam. So is Kai. Liz, you may end up being unashamedly our HM slave. You're a good Pokemon. I want you on the team. Scratch has got 40, but strength is 80. Strength is a good move. Strength is not to be sniffed at. So... But it's giving you a normal type move. 
Someone needs it. Someone needs it. Do we give it to Kai? Let's have a look at your moveset, Kai, because you do have Sandstorm, which is your innate ability anyway, so that's completely pointless. You've got Thrash, which is really strong, but it does make you confused afterwards. Scary Face is useless, but I want you to be a powerhouse, so Rock Dark would be great. And what I'm actually thinking now, Sam has Uproar at the moment, and Uproar is a brilliant move. But, Sam's whole thing is cheese. So she puts people to sleep, she poisons them, she leech seeds them. And uproar goes against that. But if we go with strength instead of uproar, it shouldn't wake people up. So there we go, Sam's got strength and her cheese remains. And don't get me wrong, I want to get some more powerful stab attacks on her, but we've got three spaces. And strength is not a bad move at all. Oh, so I actually have to go into my bag, go to Pokemon, go to Sam to use strength. But I need to use... So what? So how am I meant to get to this place? Oh, Tangrowth, you'd have been amazing. So I need a badge to use strength. I can't get that badge before beating the gym. I can't beat that gym without talking to the gym leader's grandmother. I can't get to her grandmother without going through this mountain, and I can't get through this mountain without strength. So I don't quite know how to get there. We'll fight you, because we're here. I don't know what to do. I, I don't understand right now. Oh look, it's Wells' cousin. Who's going to be quite good against us, because we're a rock. Where are we ground? Let me just double check that one. Summary. Poison ground, so we're not super weak, so we're okay. So we can fight. We can hit you with rock smash. That nah, didn't do anything like I thought it would. That bite did more than I wanted it to, but it was a crit. We're gonna go with a body slam. That did quite a bit, that did more. Screech, that's lowering my attack, isn't it? No, my defense harshly fell. Gonna go with another body slam. Boom, hopefully that finishes you off, especially if she crits. Excellent. Huntail is done for. 1000 XP for Liz, that is level 26. The team is growing, but I have no idea how to get where I need to go. That is my problem right now. I feel like an investigation is required. I can't go north. Oh, what's down here? Ooh, item. It's always quite nice. Grass knot! So that's pretty good. Okay, so let's look into this. Let's see what we can do. So, I'm back in Pastoria City, as you can tell if I go in here, and then walk out again, Pastoria City. So as it turns out, I need to instigate a battle with my rival, and that involves talking to that grunt, the green haired dude, just over there. So, we're going to go do that, we're then going to battle our rival, we should end up battling him as well, the grunt, and then we can get something to move those Psyducks aside. That was a lot of research to be able to figure out how to get through either of those two routes. So I'm sorry for 12 minutes of wasted effort today, but we're getting there now. So, let's get into it. Okay, the package finally came from the Veilstone Warehouse. Did it? I thought I'd taken them out. So, now it's my job to deliver this to the lake. This is an important mission. No failure allowed. 
No making boo-boos like wandering off into the Great Marsh. You were eavesdropping? I was just talking loudly to myself. If I wasn't in a hurry, I'd pulverize you with my Pokemon, but I have to get on my way to the lake ASAP. So you're lucky I'm out. Oh, and listen up. You, don't you dare follow me. I'm gonna follow you. Oh, you didn't get far. Huh, persistent pest. If our plan works, our boss's dream comes closer to fruition. Our boss's ideal world is going to be created, so I'm not going to waste my time on a nobody like you. I'm telling you now, don't come chasing after me. I'm gonna chase after you. No, I'm not Crash is gonna run into me. Well, I knew this was gonna happen. Whoops. Not always gonna plow into you every time we meet. So, how's it going, Doragon? Buffing up your Pokemon, eh? I'll test you and your Pokemon out, see how buff and tough you are. What have you got? Because last time you killed half our team. Oh, I'm not looking for... Oh, you've got a Regirock. Right, you're super effective against Connor, so Connor at the front is not a good idea here. I believe you might also be super effective against Sam, but Sam can put the cheese on you. Wibble Sniff and Happy are going to be super effective against you. Really depends on your moveset though, because you are a high level, man. You are a high level. Um... Double team raises my evasiveness. So hopefully this thing can't hit me. Please miss. Yes, you missed, you missed. Right, okay. Um, Sam seems the sensible one. Who's the Pokemon speed in sunshine? She's got a miracle seed. Strength could be good, especially if we get Sleep Powder on it. Gonna have to try it with Sam. I think this might be a bad move. But I can't leave Connor in there, because if Reggie Rock gets a single shot off... Please don't be super effective. Please don't be super effective. You're su oh, you're not. Sleep. Please be faster, Sam. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't, no, don't set up. You can't set up. Either. Please hit, Sam. Please hit this Sleep. Please. Please hit sleep. Please hit sleep. No! No! <laughs> and you're slower. Oh. Please hit sleep. Yes! Oh, Sam, you cheesy, brilliant thing. I don't know how long you can keep a legendary asleep, but... Oh, um, what are we doing, what are we doing, what are we doing? Fight, leech seed. Give me my health back and stay asleep. Woke up! Oh no. Oh man, 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 what do I do, what do I do, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I've got to try and sleep this thing again. I can take whatever it's thrown at me so far, so let's try sleeping it again. It slept. It slept. That's good. So it's asleep until at least next turn. I'm gonna heal up a little bit from my leech seed. That's not over effective, but I've then got strength that I can use. It shouldn't wake that thing up. Come on, Sam, come on. Oh, that did nothing. And it woke up! Oh! No, 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 this is not good. This is not good. Okay, so Sam can take anything this Reggie Rock is throwing at her. Anything at the moment. She's taking it all, so... Poison it. I 
And then we've got to swap to Kai. Although superpower, I think, is super effective against Kai. I don't rightly know. Oh, it's not very effective. That's, it's lowering the Regirock's attack and defense. That's fine. That means Leech Seed and Poison are going to do more every single time. Okay, this thing's getting lower. Let's go for a strength. It's lowered its defense. This should do more. Only a little bit more. But... Every time, this is just going to get more, better. It's going to get better for us. It's not doing as much. We're healing up. We're poisoning it. We're hitting it with strength. And it's lowering its own attack and defense every single time. Thank you, Regirock. Thank you for being not the smartest. So that's Leech Seed. Poison should basically finish this off. We'll go strength once more. It's not the most effective move against Regirock, but you keep lowering your own attack and defense. Leech Seed will finish you. No! No, 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 no! Yes! Sam! Oh, Sam! Oh, oh my god! You survived! <laughs> Oh, God, increase to 27. Oh, good Lord, that's amazing. We need to switch you out of there. I don't know what's coming in next. Nidorino. Switch Pokemon. Uh, Wibblesniff. Or just go to Wibblesniff. Sam, you beaut. You utter beaut. Oh, my days. I can't believe you survived an explosion. I can't believe that thing had explosion and waited until then to use it. Oh, my God. Okay, Bubble Beam! I can't remember what that is. Poison. Is it Poison Ground? Like, um, our Nido Queen is? Well, that wasn't double effective, but it did a lot of damage. And he's not really doing anything to us, so Wibblesniff can take this guy dead easy. Go with another Bubble Beam, mate. Because you're getting Surf shortly, so... That'd be great. Okay, Nidorino fainted, that's good. Good XP. Huntail. The only person with super effective moves that I've got is Sam. Liz will get destroyed. Connor is just completely useless. Happy is neutral. Kai will get destroyed, so we've got to leave Wibble sniffing realistically and just hope that your strength pulls through. I hope he doesn't still have Giratina as well. Although if he does, we've got Connor to slay the dragon. Crit, Wibble sniff, you beast. Not very effective, still did more than I wanted it to, but my bubble beam should finish this guy. Okay, that's Huntail done. Who is the final Pokemon? That's nice, that's a good amount of XP for Wibble Sniff there. Driftblim. So, yeah, we're gonna switch because Dark type is good against him. Don't think Kai's got dark type moves. I'll double check. No, he doesn't have dark type moves, so we're going to switch into Connor. Because Connor's got bite. And that'll do quite a bit against the Ghosty Drift Blimp. So he's just switched one legendary out for another, but that means later when he's got a team of six, he could have both Giratina and Regirock. Maybe the legendary just keeps switching to keep us on our toes, but it's terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. Come on, Connor. Come on. Defense and special defense. So this isn't going to one-shot it. 
Oh god lord. Barely does anything. Let's make me unhittable. What's that do? This thing's setting up on me. Okay, we're gonna do one more. Do we do one more double team? Or do we just hit it with bite? I think we just keep hitting it with bite now. So it's stockpiling again. Defense rows, special defense rows. So this is gonna be tough. Do we have anything stronger than Bite? I'd love to have Crunch. That'd be great right about now, but neither Kai nor Connor have it. Um, Payback, that's going to hurt. But because we're going first, it doesn't hit me as hard. It's super effective. Two more of these as long as it doesn't use Swallow. You missed, that's great. One more, one more bite. You missed. You know that whole evasiveness thing. You might end up keeping that on you, Connor, because that's kept us in this fight quite nicely without... Oh! Aftermath! Yeah, that evasiveness worked really well in our favour. That could have ended you. Good grief. All right, Crash Echo, you've lost again. That was still a really tough fight. <laughs> yeah, maybe you did get a bit tougher since last time. It even shocked me a bit, so yeah, I got beat because I was careless. So hey, what was that Team Galactic guy all freaking out about? I don't know what he's up to, but you should chase him down. If you're not a Pokemon, if you're not a Pokemon and you run like that, you're a bad guy. All right, Doragon, next time I'm not holding back. Okay, heal up time. So we nearly killed Sam, our cheese lord. Cheese lord that she is, but she's kept us in many a fight. Okay, and then we will go and see what this guy from Team Galactic wants. Assuming he's through here. He can't have got too far. He's got to be on Route 213 somewhere. Okay, one wardrobe change later. And we are back to it. Let's chase after this grunt. Wherever he's got to. Leave a green-haired Team Galactic grunt. He's not going to be through there because I didn't break the rock. Ooh, but there is that item back here. So let's go, breakings. What is the item on this occasion? Fire Blast. Well, now. And you're not a rocket grunt. You're not, you're not, you're not. Are there any cave like structures down here? Nope, nope, nope. Anybody in here who's a rocket grunt? Nope. Oh. No, no, I don't want to do... I didn't want to do that. <sighs> Did Connor get stronger? Who is... Is it Doragon's doing? Is the train road? My thanks. Doesn't leave any footprints. It's because he's a big ball. Oh, there you are. We needed the energy from the Valley Windworks to make this. It would take a scientific genius to make something like this. Therefore, our boss who made this is a scientific genius. You were eavesdropping. I was just thinking out loud you're a persistent pest. I'm getting tired of running away. But I'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around. <sighs> you're boring. Where'd he go? Where did he go? Green haired dude. Green haired dude. Anybody seen a green haired dude? Explore the nooks and crannies. Valor Lake Front. He said he was heading for a lake, didn't he? Hmm. 
There he is. Not very good at hiding, is he? <laughs> Why am I running like this anyway? That new universe that the boss was talking about. It's giving me goosebumps thinking about it. So we use this. You were eavesdropping! I was only talking to myself. You're persistent too. I'm pooped out from all the running. But I'm not going to battle you. I really want to fight you. Really want to fight you. You're still on my tail? The lake's within sight. You leave me no choice. My Pokemon will KO you. Finally! And you've only got, after all that, you've only got one Pokemon? And it's a Relicamp. Rock water, so... I really don't know if Connor's any good here. Well, I'll do a double team first. Just make sure he can't hit us. Connor's evasiveness rose. And he rose his defense. Okay, between us, we're, we're, we're setting up. Right. Fight. Let's go with an icy wind. Let's see what that does to it. I don't think this is going to do a lot. No, it's not. But it does slow it down, even though it's slow anyway. Wow, he actually hit a rock tomb. That's going to hurt. Very badly. So we're going to switch Pokemon. Going to switch to Whipple Sniff. <sighs> because he's rock type. I think he's got some weakness to water, mate. Oh, please no. Please no. Do not put me to getting drowsy. Okay, we can get a bubble beam off. Go Whipple Sniff. So this should be fairly effective. Should be. Yes, it is. That's going to do nothing to me, but whether I'm awake for the next turn is a different matter. I'm not. We'll bring Happy out, because Happy can do this. Plus, we need Happy to get some XP and grow. Miss, miss, yes, thank you. Fight bubble. I should finish you off. Or not. But that's not going to do anything either. Okay, cool. Just keep going with bubble for the moment then. That bubble beam of wibble sniffs is just so strong. I'm thinking, would it be better to put Surf on Happy rather than Wibble Sniff and leave Wibble Sniff open for? Or is it HM? Because I can then put it on both. I can't remember whether it's a HM. Because if it is, I can put it on both of them, and that's just going to be clutch. So Mythic with that is just going to be great. A good XP gain by everybody there. Poet Forest is defeated. If I didn't run, I could have battled harder. Nice round thousand. I can't battle anymore, I'm running on fumes. I'll have to give this to the commander. I wish I got to use it at the lake. Come back! Oh, that's Crash again. I really need to heal up before going anywhere near him. So let's go talk to the hotel. Ah, hello, you wish you stay then. I blah 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 blah. Just heal me, man. You've healed your Pokemon for. Oh, no, 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 no. This is why you spam B after you've accepted something. Rude is what that was. Rude, I tell ye. Right, let's go talk to Crash. Oh, it's Cynthia. Oh, hello. Long time no see. How is your Pokedex filling up? I came to research the folklore about the lake, but, well, it doesn't appear as if the lake is open to the public now. Have you heard the folklore about it? They say there is an island inside the lake. 
and inside that island is a mirage of a Pokemon. No one must enter the chamber of that Pokemon. Sorry to change the subject, but have you seen the group of Psyduck on Route 210? Yes, yes I have. Been trying to get past them for a while now. By the cafe. You've seen that group of Psyduck? Oh come on, huddled with the heads in the hands. What you should do is use this medicine. Oh yes. Secret potion can get past the Psyduck. And get on to the 4th? 5th? A gym? Next. I hope you meet every kind of Pokemon there is to see. It may help you with the secret of the Mirage Pokemon. See you later. Okay, let's go get past those Psyduck now. Charge! 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 Oh, I can just charge around that. Why would I go through it? Oi! Charge! Have I fought you? I feel like I haven't. We haven't. We definitely haven't fought you. For the sake of my collection, I take on people I know I can't beat. That's what a collector does. Okay, mate. Chef Florentino sent out a bonsle. Rock type, not grass type. Just because it looks like a tree doesn't mean it is a tree. It's a Pokemon, gotta catch him all. I'm gonna go Wibble Sniff just because his water moves are that much better right now. Oh, he's still asleep, isn't he? Oh no, I've healed him. Excellent, yes. Low kick. Ouch. Yeah, actually, ouch. Okay, Bubble Beam. Thought it'd be enough to one shot, but you know, you know when you just pay attention to that health bar going down. You know, like, please, please, please. So, Bonsley's don't fall. Bastardon. Wait, right, he's still rock type, I believe, so. We'll keep battling. You're a big beefcake. Let's go, Bubble Beam. Wow, we one shot a Bastardon. It was a critical, though. Super effective crit. Always helpful. Wow, that's a lot of XP. That'll be level 30 for Wibble Sniff. Carrying man, you and Connor now. Since the loss of Wurzdal and Hannah. Oh man, they still hurt. Brine. Okay, what's Brine do? So I'm not really using my other water move, which is Water Gun. Brine. The foe's HP is down to about half this attack will hit double. It hits pretty well anyway. What does Water Gun do? Water Gun... Yeah, it's just better than Water Gun all round. You're growing well, Wibble Sniff. You're growing well. Blaziken! You know what? We'll just keep battling. Wibble Sniff is... Great against everything you've got, but my days I wish I had one. Wish I had a Blaziken. Let's hit you with a Brine then. See if this one shots. Wow, Wibble Sniff. What a beast. One shotted every Pokemon in this guy's party. Got a lot of XP. A lot of XP. Wowzers, that's intense. Right, we need to do some switching around, have somebody else out front. Who's the lowest level? Happy is the lowest level, so we're going to put Happy up front. Because we want Happy to grow. Found this side of things. Anything? Nothing? Have I fought you? I must have fought you. There's an item through there. Lake Valor that way. Darn it, encounter. We've had the encounter from here. It's not a new encounter. Hello, Bidoof. What's well, super effective against Bidoof? I don't really know. We're gonna... You know what? We're actually gonna attack this, but we're gonna switch into Kai first. Boom. Kill. Oh yeah, Sandstream. I keep forgetting I've got that on Kai. Roll out, gonna do nothing here, mate. Because we are rock type. 
Whereas you, I believe, are normal type. So we can come with Rock Slide and end your existence, I think. I'm right. 95 XP, it's not a lot, but it's some. It's, it's, it's moving us towards something better. Found an antidote. Always useful. Always useful. Ah, yes, because I came down that side, didn't I? And noticed there was a Giratina. So that means I need to fight this person as well. I sensed the presence of a trainer for a while. It was you. How many do you have? Two. Swamp it. Swamp it, the ultra tank. I literally have no one super effective against you. Nobody super effective against you. You're ground as well. Sam is a risky play, but if we can put you to sleep... That's all right, water gun. Now, if we can hit this sleep next time out. Please hit it, Sam. Yes! You're a cheesy beast, you really are. I love it. Okay, so Swamp is asleep. He's a final evolution and he's an utter tank. He's not going to stay asleep for long. So let's leech seed him. He's asleep. How did he evade it? <sighs> Breathe. Usa. Try again. There we go. Excellent. Right. Stay asleep, please. Yes. Right. This should do some good damage because it's super effective against you. That's nice. That's actually really nice. Let's hit you with a strength. Don't know how well this is going to do against Swampert, because he is just an utter tangling nothing. Absolutely nothing. That's mad. Okay, so it's leeched by leech seed. What we're going to do whilst you're asleep, we're going to switch into... Yes, we are going to switch into Wibble Sniff. Because there's nobody else who can really do anything different against him or be super weak to him. There we go, he woke up. He used Foresight. Odd move for you to be using there. I'd have gone attacking after a few moves asleep. But we're going to heal Wibble Sniff up now as well, which is always clutch. Hit you with a twister, let's see what that does. I'm hoping that does a bit. It did quite a bit, actually. That's nice. That's not going to do much, and Leech Seed is going to replenish what you take anyway. Oh, actually, you hit me quite hard there. I'm hoping this is the end of you. Not quite. So yeah, we'll hit you with another twister. Because that'll finish you off. That's some good XP for people there. 345 around the board. That's just great XP for everybody. About to send in Diglett. Diglett's ground type, so ground is super effective against water. But I think it's weak to rock, so we are going to switch Pokemon. We are going to go to... Liz, what are you? Ground Poison. We're going to go into Kai. Or is Kai weak to ground? Uh, this could be a problem, we'll see. It's only a Diglett. So we should be able to just stomp it into... Oblivion. Sandstorm's whipped up. Fight, we're gonna hit it with a rock slide. Wow, 
somehow did nothing, and that was apparently super effective. Oh, but my accuracy has fallen. Not that it matters. Hit him anyway. Go Kai. Not very effective. That was just pure damage. That was just how strong Kai is. It's nice. 399 XP. That's nice. And Scott is defeated. All good work. All great work. Okay, let's go get rid of those Psyduck. Or battle this ga gal. You want to teach me something about Pokemon? Yes, I do. Yes, yes, I do. Gent Jessica. Magneton. We have got to get out of there. I think Kai is the move here again. I might be wrong. Liz might be the better move. I can never tell. Rock and ground, I always get mixed up. But putting Kai in is a Tyranitar. You can never really go wrong with a Tyranitar. Spark. That's going to hurt a bit. It's not terrible, though. I think this guy's immune to rock. He's not getting buffed by the Sandstream at all. Not very effective. So it's ground that you are weak to. Dang it. Okay, we'll switch into Liz, see what Liz has got for us. It doesn't affect Liz. That's amazing. That's amazing. This shouldn't affect Liz either. No, it doesn't. We're gonna go with a Rock Smash, a fighting move. Super effective. Liz was definitely the right move here. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Quite a bit. Quite a bit, actually. Let's just finish you off with another Rock Smash. That should be the end of Magneton. And it is. How many Pokemon did you have? Was it three? I think it was three. 286, 429. Oh yeah, she's still got the lucky egg on. And Jessica is defeated. Okay, we continue moving upwards. We do it on this. I can't do it on this outside. I was hoping to get into that next up oh, before he spotted me. Let's kick his ass. Let's kick him into oblivion. I mean, he's got, he's got three. Starts with a drift bloom. Happy you're not going to be able to do anything here. Again, nice XP though. Really should put the lucky egg on you. We need to switch to Connor, our dragon and ghost slayer. It's setting up. None of this matters because I'm quicker and I have bite. It's super effective against you and you're going to flinch. Called it. One more bite and you're done for. Oh, Connor. Connor, 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 you're just so good. Drifblim had aftermath, of course it did. Of course it did. 480 XP though, that's good. That's nice, happy. Good HP, good attack. For a level 23, that's really good. Really good, actually. 28 for Connor as well. Good rank ups, good rank ups. It's a lot of additional HP, to be fair. Look at those attacks and defense. Yes, you can learn Ice Fang. Yes, you can learn Ice Fang. Uh, headbutt will be forgotten. Although Headbutt's 70. What's Ice Fang? 65. Bot. Yeah, 
forget headbutt, forget headbutt. About sending Minon. It's ground type is going to be best here, which is Liz, but I don't think you've got anything super effective against it, whereas Kai does. Thought about the sandstorm. That's gonna hurt us. Spark, that's gonna do a whole heap of not a lot to a big beefy Tita. Oh, Kai. Just one shotting people. And you look sufficiently grumpy as well. Blissey. Oh, great. Normal type. So nothing super effective against it. Everything's a little bit neutral. I am going to switch. I am going to throw Happy in, and then I'm probably coming back into Kai. Or going to Wibble Sniff, because they can hit hardest at the moment. And that thing is just an utter tank. As far as tanks in this game go, like, Blissey's top. Top tank. Oh, that's a problem, that's evasiveness. <sighs> At least the Sandstorm will keep buffeting it. Which is nice. It's not going to do a lot, but... It helps bit by bit. We are quicker, so Rock Slide should hit it and do a ton. I want you to see most of its health here, Kai. Oh my god, look how slow that health is going down. It's six levels below me, and it still took that long to empty the health bar. Wow. It can just, it can just take anything. It's a sponge, a damage sponge. Please don't. Oh, I've already battled you. Yes. Already battled you. So we're going to continue up here. We're going to get to the side duck, and I'm going to call it at the side duck, I think. We'll get them out of the way. Oh, yeah, I've got to go out of Veilstone. Wow, it's a long way back. Through we go. Route 250. Oh my days, we are so far back. I didn't want to do that. I really didn't want to do that. Hey, Deli Bird. He should be really powerful in these conditions, but I am going to run anyway. Just because it's a waste of time. How do we do? Can't get there. Why can't I get there? There we go. Trainer tips. Don't want you. So I'll get off this route. Like that. Then want to head this way. This is route 210. Here are the Psyduck. They aren't inclined to move. Would you like to use the secret potion? Yes, yes I would. Psyduck appear to be cured of their chronic headache. Hey, I'd have a Psyduck. See you later, guys. Cynthia! Oh good, you've used the secret potion I gave you. Psyduck are known to suffer from chronic headaches, but no one's been able to figure out what triggers these headaches. Oh yes, can I ask you a big favour? 
I want you to deliver this old charm to my grandma in Celestic Town. I know there are some rare Pokemon between here and Celestic Town, so it'd be worth your while to go. Yeah, sure, why not? We'll deliver the old charm, why not? My grandma has this sort of bossy atmosphere about her. I think you'll recognise her right away. Yes, I'm sure you will. She's the elder of Celestic Town. And the location? Look on your town map. You can't miss it. Okay, I'm counting on you. See you again down the road. Excellent, so that's it for this episode, guys. I'd like to thank you all very much for tuning in. Do not forget to like the video, hit subscribe and the bell for when new episodes go live. In the meantime, my name is Doragon. This is Pokemon Diamond Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. And until next time, folks, take care. Mm.